Hello everyone, welcome back to the Iconic Design. So today we are here to discuss an interesting topic that is the Hope UI Figma kit and a design system. Uh, this is Vidisha Mistri working as a UX UI designer from Iconic Design. So before starting with the UI kit, I give you a short overview about the Hope UI. It is a production ready dashboard UI kit and a design system uh, through which you can make your web app super fast. It has a lot to offer to budding designers and developers like you with a number of the elements like components, variants, pages and much more. Hope UI is thoughtfully designed for a user-centric projects without starting from the scratch. So before starting with the Hope UI, let's discuss about why we have made a Hope UI in the Figma. Any guesses? Comment below. As it provides the most usable features that is the auto layout through which you can change your layout structure without bothering the other portions of the design. Along with the auto layout, Hope UI contains other features of the Figma that is to create the components, variants, effect styles, text styles, color styles and much more. Hope UI is also available in Adobe XD and Sketch 2. Now let's begin with our design system. Speaking about the design system, you can notice there are the massive varieties of the components like add-ons, alerts, badges, buttons, forms and so on. You can see from here it is so clean and beautifully placed that anyone can utilize it. Furthermore, there are many color palette styles that makes your work super super easy. By just changing at the one place, it can change throughout your web apps. It follows the global system, you know. So simple, yeah? I know it. Another feature that include is heading styles. That is from H1 to H6 with the additional styles like paragraph, title, spell, special links and much more. You can check it later on. Moving aside, you can see other design systems like sizing, pixel grid, type scale and title styles. Apart from the design system, if you see here, there is a code button. On clicking, you can get this code directly and use them in your web app. This option is available for developers. So this was our design system that is used in our Hope UI and uh, now we will move to the other page that is the components. Components are the elements you can reuse in your across your design. Uh, this could be the complete range of the layouts then components, buttons and much more. As you can see here, we have bifurcated our components into generic one that is the most usable elements used throughout the Hope UI like buttons in which you can see we have a variance like corner buttons, rounded buttons, then with icon without icon and much more nail bar then sidebar with the five plus styles and the list goes on you can see below then moving to the generic two uh, we have listed over here icons tables and search bar are added in this section that is the generic two likewise there are the certain components for the particular app that is like e-commerce there are the product cards with the different variants you can see over here there are different variants of the product cards then wish list page profiles etc same for the blog web app social web app file manager and other apps are included in this section so this was the end of the component now we will proceed to the next page that is the layout where pre-designed layouts are already designed for the designers like you to make your job effortless let's get into detail so here you can see this is a default dashboard that holds the profile graph total balances these all are the components which we have already designed over here you can see there are so many widgets recently view product card and so on let's take a tour of an, one of our web app let's take e-commerce web app you can see here there are the four different pages in the sidebar that is the admin dashboard vendor dashboard product detail and shop pages moving towards the right side you can see there are the graphs which we have already added this in our components you can use them and make your web apps based on your product purchase you can clearly get your total number of the sales then customer gender your top rated product and many more the product list holds different filter sidebar that has a basic content like category average customer review price range and much more the product can 
be displayed in the list and the grid side. Now we will visit the product detail page that is beautifully created and positioned in a neat view. You can see additionally pages like wish list, card, checkout, payment, invoices, user profile and this list runs on and on. You can visit later on. Now we will discuss the social web app. This is an interesting one. It is based on our daily social web apps. The dashboard has insights like profile reach, engagement users, page impressions, key matrices and much more. Moving down the news feed page carries the latest news stories and activities of the user including a headline, friend request and messaging a friend too. Sending request to your friend is also added. Along with that, you can manage your profile with badges, images, birthdays, notifications and more. Further pages like events, groups, social profile and chats are listed below. You can check it later on. So this was the end of our layout page moving further we are going to the next that is the widget page where multiple charts forms counters and tables are used throughout our web apps you can easily use in your web apps here we have completed our overview now i will show you a quick making of a dashboard with our pre-made components that are available in the ui kit so firstly take a frame then you can adjust width and height according to yours i am making by my own after that we will add a background color by a pre-made styles see we have already given the styles you can easily change color from here now add components from assets you can see here we have a component list add a sidebar to the left of our frame then navbar along with that add footer from the generic one that we have already explained you in the components and if you are using uh, other elements you can just get it from the assets here from the left panel now we will add a grid to align our elements properly so it will look neat and clean so now i will use pre-made widgets for the demo app that we have discussed earlier you can use of your own choice and create your own design i am creating by my now i will add the components also but we'll skip this process because it's the same for all the portion we'll move to the result this is our dashboard is looking see it's so super fast made from our pre-made components on our blank page you can do the same for yours too so this is the end of our video i hope you have enjoyed so there are many videos related to this hope ui that will guide you the entire hope ui pro that will make your time and the work efficiency in your project and if you are not a professional or a big organization and don't want to buy a paid version then check our website where free version is available and yeah don't forget to like subscribe and click on the bell icon below and don't forget to share within your designer community so that everyone can take the advantage of the design of a future admin UI. Till then, bye bye. See you in the next video. And yeah, if you have any problem regarding to Hope UI or any product of our iconic design, comment below and yeah, suggestions are most welcome. Thank you. Bye bye.